Okay guys, welcome back to my channel, Introverts Anonymous, where I am an introvert and I do prefer to remain anonymous, at least for now. We do have yet again another unboxing, but this one is slightly different. This is actually from a D stash, so let's get into it while I also tell you where the hell I've been. Okay, so this one is from, as you can see... Uh, what is it? Mary's Diamonds. So I've never had a Mary's Diamonds kit before. And as you know, it is now uh, Bella Art uh, Diamonds from Bella Art de Nicole. So this is the original from Mary's Diamonds when it was Mary's Diamonds. All right, let's see what we got in here. So let's get, oh, I'm so sorry. Let's get into, oh, here it is. There's a little close up of that thingy right there. Can you see that? Yeah. So, um, the reason I haven't been posting, oh, and I also did, uh, tell the, um, the, the person that I got this from that no need to worry about a toolkit because shit, I have a lot of it, but this, I think is like a Bella Art de Nicole tray. So this is the first one I have. I guess I'll test it out. Okay. Um, the reason why I haven't been posting and also... The reason why, oh, pretty nice. The reason why I don't post that often and usually don't share a lot about my personal life on here is because a lot of my personal life isn't exactly um, good. I have been through a lot. Let me get this out and then I'll continue talking. Yeah, I've been through a lot in my life and. I would say a good 90% of it is not pleasant. Let's unroll this. So first observation of this canvas is it is um, it is not as heavyweight as Diamond Art Club, but as you can see, the back is soft. So that's a good thing. Um, it's not like a more heavier weight canvas. It is poured glue, so it does roll properly. It does feel like it has a thick piece of plastic on top. And since the plastic is um, also, I can kind of tell the glue is a bit more sturdy. So just from the feel of it, I can kind of tell that from the weight of the canvas, you can kind of, you know, get certain little things. And again, if you're a new, uh, person to diamond painting the how should I say this oh here we go well ain't you cute that is very nice hopefully I got the colors right it's a little bit more blue than it appears on camera it's more blue on camera it looks a little bit pur purple um so since this is poured glue you see that little bubble there look at this gone if it was double-sided adhesive then you'd have a problem. Um, as I stated, the plastic is a little bit thicker. And yes, that glue is definitely, as you can see, thick. You hear that smack? Yeah. So that's good glue. The symbols are very clear, but also this is a very, very simple picture. So there should be no problems with this in terms of how it's going to be rendered. Um, and from, as you can see here, you have your key. This does have 38 colors and you have it upside down as well. But in my case, that doesn't matter because I only work from the top left corner across and then down. So let us get, oh, she did put in the toolkit. Oh, well, I was just trying to save her some weight, but thanks. I appreciate it. Let's see what this toolkit has. All right. So back to talking about me. So as I was saying, a lot of my life isn't pretty. I've, I've been through a lot. Um, so that's why I usually don't share it. Uh, there you go. You have a washi tape. Pretty nice. Um, you do have the tweezer. You got your murder mittens here. Okay. Pretty sturdy tweezers. So that's good. Oh, they have blue, whatchamacallit? Blue, blue wax. I've never had blue wax before. Let me see if it has the film on top. Yes, it does. Because to my, my dumb ass sometimes don't even remember that. But yeah. That's why I don't really share it, and I mean, I do suffer from depression as well, and I don't want to bring that energy on this channel. So what I am thinking about doing is possibly 
starting another channel um, where I can discuss some of the things that I've been through and how I got through them. And, you know, hopefully that might help someone. Oh, okay. We got some multi-placers in here. So it looks like you have a three, two or a three placer on one end. You got your regular single placer on the other end. And you also get, um, this looks like a six or a seven placer. Maybe a five and a seven placer? Possibly, yeah. So, and part of my hands, yes, they're dry and crusty as hell because of the job that I do. That seems to be the one universal thing <laughs> for the job that I do. And no, it's not manufacturing. It's, it's a whole lot more specialized than that. But, yeah, I'm thinking of starting another channel um, where I can uh, discuss some of those things and hopefully, you know, help someone else going through it. Um, sometimes when I'm going through a lot, I don't even tell my friends shit. I'll, I'll disappear for literally years at a time <laughs> because you always feel like, you know, in your life, it's just drama, 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 and very little light at the end of any tunnel. And you don't want to burden anybody with that. And you feel like it's just the same story repeating itself over and over and over again. And it's never like any, like I said, bright spots. There are very few and far between. All right. So let's take a look at that. Like I said, it's more bluer. Um, I'm sorry that this filter, I guess, has a little bit of yellow tinge to it. But hey. But it does look a little bit yellow, though, the um the paper. So I'm not sure. Oh, here we go. This is called Lays from, who is this? Jeff Payne's. Um, it is through Mary's Diamonds, and it is a full drill square because I do not do rounds unless I accidentally pick them up by accident, which is a very big accident to have. It does come with pre-cut stickers, and they are very bright, and, the, and they are also big enough for my blind eyes to see. And I will say the same off the key as well. As you can see there, the drill field is very, very, very clear. There we go. And again, since this is a simple image, there is no reason why that drill field should not be very clear. Um, as you can see, they come in little baggies. Oh, it does have ABs. Well, duh. I didn't notice that. We have one, two, three ABs on here. Yeah, so it does come with ABs. And they are in the little Ziploc bags. And that is perfectly fine with me. Hey, if I ain't got a kid up, that's more or less thing I ain't got to do. Amen? Amen. All right, let's get in here and take a look at one of these. I'm not going to take out all of them. I'm just going to take a look at like one or two colors. I'll maybe take a look at a light color and maybe a dark color. All right, so let's get a look at this. So um, that channel, I, I don't know if I'll be brave enough to do it, but if I do it, I will not be showing my face on there because it's going to tell a lot of stories about, well, not stories, a lot of truths about the things I've went through. Uh, the things that were done to me from family members and such. And look at this, guys. These bottoms are flat. Now, I can't cast any judgment on this kit until I actually start working on there. I can't say if it's good. I can't say if it's bad. I can't say anything from what I can see here. I like what I see. I like the clarity of the um, the drill field. I love the, the, that. Well, I love the clarity of the drill field. And these are the thicker zip flop bags. So that is great as well. I love the clarity of the drill field. I um, like that the key doesn't look, uh, you know, scattered, if you want to call it that, jumbled. So I do like that as well. Uh, let me put out some more of these. I like that. I like that they come in baggies, and these are the thicker baggies, so I love that too. I like the, the stickers. I like that it comes with stickers. Let's get a little shaky, 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 shaky. There we go. And the drills do seem to be uh, of even size. I don't see any little potholes on top, no smiley faces or anything. So that is very, very good. All right. I like that. The tray. Huh. Let's take a look at that. Let me get out the tweezers so you can kind of get a look at what I'm seeing. Yeah. But, yeah, I won't be showing any my face in there at all. 
Um, so that's that's the one thing I'm trying to figure out how to come up with a background and make the background stay because I don't know how to do that. Um, but yeah. Okay, so this is what I'm seeing. Let me see if I could, you see that little gap in between the, the drill right there and, the, and where that grid line is, that little itty bitty gap. So I don't like that because for me, when I'm trying to uh, multi-place, then some of them are like in the middle. Some of them are like on the edge. Some of them are perfectly straight inside the multi-placer. And then when you put them on the kits, on, on your canvas, you know, it doesn't come out right. So I had this problem with another tray that I purchased and I used it one day and I never used it again. I'll probably just de-stash de it. So I don't like that. So like I said, there's a little tiny itty bitty gap right in between the grid line and the drill right there. So I don't know if I'll actually use this tray. Um, I'll give it a shot, but I doubt that I'm going to like using this tray. So, um, and if any, uh, uh, like I said, the channel I'm thinking about doing, if, you know, anybody's interested when I get it up, just, you know, leave me a comment below so I can maybe put a link to it or something like that. But yeah, so that's where I've been. I don't like, I don't want to share any negative energy here with you guys, so that's why I don't um I don't post when my as we say where I'm from my spirit isn't clean <laughs> well let's get a dark color let's get um this blue I'm assuming this is 939 and it does go by DMC order on here so I do appreciate that what the hell is this this is 823 okay Let's see, 823. Yeah, but if you guys are interested, hey, hit me up and let me know. Yeah, let's see if there's any concave, anything. Let's see. I can't see. Yeah, I do see some concave on here. I do see some, but let's give her a little tweak and a shake. All right. But it does look fine, so that's good. The thing with the concave drill is sometimes it doesn't stick to the canvas. Um, I think these are resin drills. It looks like they appear to be resin drills. So that's a good thing as well. Yeah. Anyways, guys, if any of you have any experience from working with the past Mary's Diamonds and then now... Oh, never mind. I did not notice this. Girl, you is slow. Look what I just saw, people. So this is also from when it was under Bella Art de Nicole. Oh, which is now Bella Art Diamonds. So there you go, guys. I didn't realize that. So this possibly is one of the newer kits. All right. Yeah, there you go. Bella Art Diamonds right there. Well, Bella Art de Nicole, so yes. I didn't realize that. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, this is a 40 by 40. Um, looks a little bit tinier than the actual 40. Just a, just a sneeze smaller, yeah, but. So at least now you guys know what to expect. But if any of you worked on the previous Mary Di Mary's Diamonds, um, as well as work on the current Bella Art Diamonds kit. Please let me know what your experience with them was. Um, yeah, just let me know what your experience was with them. Please, I uh, appreciate that. But anyways, thank you guys for joining me for yet again another unboxing. Um, like, comment, share, subscribe. Alrighty, and don't forget, Introvert Synonymous, where I am an introvert. And I still prefer to remain anonymous. Bye.